Edinburgh University presented the Edinburgh University Friends of Music concert in Lewis C. Cole Memorial Auditorium on April 21st, hosting the Erie Philharmonic. Before the concert, the university honored Miss Lorraine Vitt by establishing a scholarship in her name. Now I can reciprocate and provide music education scholarships to Edinburgh University students. For this, I am very grateful. The Philharmonic's second song of the night was Ashes and Equinox, a tune that was composed by William P. Alexander, the man whom the music building on campus is named. <laughs> Mr. Alexander was in attendance. High brass instructor Sarah Scouten made her Philharmonic debut as the group played Richard Strauss's Horn Concerto No. 1 in E flat. <laughs> Shouten spoke about her experience after the show. Well, it's a great opportunity and one that I've been practicing for and working hard for, for quite a few weeks. Um, but when you first walk on stage, it's a mix of just being super excited and also being nervous and finding the balance to channel the nervous energy into the excited energy so that it um, manifests itself in a good performance. Scouten also spoke about what advice she would give to her students. It's, it's a difficult thing because we come out and we perform mm -hmm. and then we go home. So most of the times our students don't see, they don't see their teacher practice. They don't see us put in the day-to-day -day, um, work. But that's what I would tell them, that this concerto didn't happen overnight. It's been years of working on the basic fundamentals of musicianship and then putting them into context into this piece. For ETV, I'm Drew Patrick.